fabulous question. With these kind of questions, there's no template to solve them. Right? A, B, C, and D are in AP. So A, B, C, D are in AP. What can we say about terms B, C, D, A, C, D, A, B, D, and A, B, C? What type of sequence is it formed? Is that also an AP? Is that a GP? Is that a HP? None of the three. Something like that. Something we need to answer about this. Right? Match term to term. See if we can find a pattern. A and then B, C, D, B, A, C, D, C, A, B, D, D, A, B, C. The other three variables are used. Right? So, we have to somehow link these up. Right? So, we have A, B, C, D in AP. Remember, 2A, 2B, 2C, 2D would be in AP. 5A, 5B, 5C, 5D would be in AP. A multiplying by anything will still give us an AP. Dividing by anything would still give us an AP. So, somehow we should look to multiply or divide to retain an AP and then work with that. Fine. So, the best possible way to multiply this or divide this is to multiply this sequence by 1 by ABCD. So, this term would become 1 by BCD, 1 by ACD, 1 by ABD, 1 by ABC. These are also in AP. Why did we choose 1 by ABCD? Because we want to cancel off A and have only BCD. We have A here, only BCD here. That one term we need to knock off. Or 1 by BCD, 1 by ACD, 1 by ABD, 1 by ABC are in AP. What can we say about BCD, ACD, ABD, ABC? Reciprocals are in AP. This particular term is in HP. So these terms are in harmonic progression. So if three terms are in AP, the reciprocals are said to be in HP. So if A, B, C and D are in AP, then B, C, D, A, C, D, A, B, D and A, B, C are in HP.